What are you doing in there? Hey guys, it's like 8 a.m. I'm just doing another mask over my breakouts because a couple um like came to the service service came to the service came to the surface after last night's mud mask. So I'm just doing another one. Um and then I'm going to film today because I really feel like filming. I don't know what kind of look I want to do. I'm thinking I might do like a drugstore makeup tutorial because I haven't done one in a while, just like all using drugstore makeup. I will do some more half half face ones because you guys love them every time I do them. But those take a long time to like plan and make sure that they're like perfect. So I'll probably do that, you know, maybe next month when I'm not so hectic with all this traveling. So yeah, I think I'll do a drugstore makeup tutorial because like this foundation of my favorites I needed to use. And so why not go all out, you know. Um, and then I'll probably just edit this afternoon and I want to walk the dogs because I didn't go to the gym this morning. Um, I've decided like, you know, on filming days I'll probably just walk later on rather than walk in the morning if that makes sense because otherwise i get home a lot later and sometimes i have to wash my hair if it's really oily and sweaty <laughs> i don't think i'm gonna have breakfast because when i eat breakfast without working out like quite early like it's quite early still sometimes i feel a bit ill so i'm just gonna wait a little bit before i eat anything um oh actually i should go set up today's video that's what i'm gonna do while this dries hey guys so this is the makeup tutorial i filmed it's all drugstore makeup so I'm really happy with how it turned out the quality is amazing as you can see like you could look at this and think it was high-end so yeah I don't know when that'll be up but I will edit it soon now I'm gonna do a lip swatch video on the rest of my Kat Von D liquid lipsticks I think anyway all done now I'm gonna make a smoothie for lunch I'm quite hungry but I just feel like smoothie so I'm gonna have that and then if I'm still hungry later I'll just have a snack by the way on my lips right now is candy kiss by Gerard Cosmetics my lip gloss it's so pretty So I know it looked like I put a whole lot of random stuff in, but there's protein, chia seeds, flax seed, um, and matcha tea in this today. I just thought I'd add some extra vitamins and goodness and good fats and things. And then we didn't have any more almond milk in the fridge, so I just used soy because it was in there. Because I use soy milk in my mashed potatoes. I don't really drink it that much, I just kind of have it for mashed potatoes. <laughs> this is so good. Why is it so good? Probably because I didn't put good green stuff in it. I got some mail and I already opened it up, so it's nice and easy for me to show you. I'm so excited. Okay, so got some stuff from MAC. I'll show you that first. So this is the Eyes on MAC collection, I think. So there's like eyeshadows and shadow sticks and things. Look how cool that image is. Fishies. So they sent me two of these MAC color sticks, waterproof color sticks. This is so cool. I might have to do like a waterproof makeup tutorial one day and like full on like go in water and like see how well it lasts. And then I got this eyeshadow palette. This is the Pastel Times 9 palette. It's really beautiful. I really like the colors. I love that light pastel blue. So pretty. I have so many ideas for tutorials using that. And then the last thing they sent me is the... Pro Beyond Twisted Lash Mascara. Really cool packaging. And then I also got a package from Gerard Cosmetics with some of their new lip liners. So I've got Peachy Keen, Nude, Sheer, and Immortal. So I'll open them and show you them. I love the packaging. I've seen them on Instagram already. How cool is this packaging? They're just like a little resharpenable pencil. So I'll definitely try these in videos. Just finished editing a vlog and a beauty video. I did a everyday like rose gold makeup tutorial and I like began editing more thumbnails and stuff of like the look I did today. I haven't decided what picture I want to use yet. So I've just got some up on my screen. I'm going to continue tomorrow because it is 5.30. So it's time for me to take some time off. We appreciate this pile of toys by Louise Bed. Such a hoarder. This is why there are toys everywhere. This, this is why. Hi! 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 That's my lettuce. I'm gonna make burgers for dinner since we didn't have them last night since I couldn't be bothered cooking. Even though this is like a really easy, 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 easy thing to make. And I'm quite hungry. I've only just started getting hungry since I had my smoothie for like lunch, light lunch.
can't wait to take off my makeup. I just want to like rub it in my face. I don't know why. You know like when you've just been wearing makeup all day and you're just like, oh, get it off. We just finished watching The Killing. What do you think, Hamish? Hmm? What do you think about The Killing? Yeah, it was really good. It was just weird to see that the last season was season four and it had six episodes. Yeah, it was just like over. We were like, oh, we must have caught up. And then Hamish Googled it. It was like, oh yeah, it ended in like 2014. We were like, wait, what? Yeah, apparently heaps of people were angry because at the end of season one, you didn't find out who the killer was. Mm. But then you found out in season two, but because we watched it... Yeah, like together, back to back. It was fine. And I reckon, honestly, I reckon the series is like four out of five, five out of five. Easy. It's so good. Yeah, I really liked it. The last episode was just so full on and so much happened and it was confusing though. Well, not confusing, it was just like... Well, we didn't know it was the last episode. So yeah, I know. It that much more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. I feel like they could have like spread it out over like three or four episodes. They just all like it all happened at once, and it was just like okay. And it's then we were though. like, what happens next? But that was it. So yeah, it was still really good. But the last season was kind of like confusing. Not confusing. A little bit confusing. I think yeah, it was it was a little bit mopey to begin with. Yeah, mopey. And it's like oh, pull me, pull me, pull me. Yeah. Which, fair enough, but still. I wanted to see the murder stories. And it was just like, all like this personal stuff. And I was just like, ugh, I don't care. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to go to sleep now. I'm getting my hair done tomorrow. Get my roots done and get my hair toned because it's gone like yellow. Talk to you tomorrow.